Hello. This short video tutorial shows how to send and receive secure email messages using LockMagic. If you are not familiar with how to get set up with LockMagic, you should view the video tutorials on how to use LockMagic with Google Drive and Gmail or how to register with LockMagic. This video will show you how to send a secure email message to one or more people, how to decrypt a secure email message that you received and reply to it, and finally, how LockMagic protects your email if it leaks out to unauthorized people. To send a secure message, log into LockMagic using your Google account. Either from the main page or the Google Drive page, click on Send Mail. The email page should be familiar to you since it looks like most web-based email applications. Type the subject, email addresses of the recipients in the to and CC list, and the message. Optionally, you can attach files from local files, Google Drive when using your Google account, or OneDrive when using a Microsoft account. You should note that attachments are encrypted as part of the overall message and not individually. If you wish to prevent recipients from sharing attachments with others, then select the Copy Protect option. This will force the recipient to open the message inside the LockMagic Secure Viewer, which requires downloading LockMagic Client. You can also set an expiry date which indicates how long this email message can be read. As you just saw, sending a secure email is not much different than sending a regular email. In fact, your Gmail or Hotmail sent folder will have a copy of the message when you log on to LockMagic using your Google or Microsoft account. At times, the recipient's email servers may mark the email as spam or a junk email. You should inform the recipients of this possibility. Recipients of a secure email will not see the email body or its attachments in a clear text. To decrypt the message and attachments, LockMagic has to verify the identity of the recipient. To initiate this process, download the attached file to the message that you have received and open it. Before the file is opened, the user is prompted for his credential. Upon providing the correct information and before the content of the email is completely decrypted, LockMagic verifies the user is authorized to see the message and the message hasn't expired. After the user reads an email, he or she can reply to the sender or everyone on the email thread. Notice that you cannot edit the to or CC list during reply. Now let's see what happens if the email gets forwarded to someone not initially on the list. We are going to send this email to a friend who has registered their email with LockMagic. When this person gets the email, he will go through the same process as other recipients trying to decrypt the email. However, this time he was not on the original email list after he logged into LockMagic he will receive the message that he is not authorized to view the content of the message. As you saw, LockMagic Secure Email enables people and organizations to simplify secure sharing of digital assets while enforcing controls. This wraps up a quick tutorial on how to use LockMagic Secure Email. Please review our video tutorial on how to use LockMagic with Google Drive and Gmail how to register with LockMagic, and how to share files securely using LockMagic. Have a good day, 
and please send us your comments and feedback to info at lockmagic.com.